My name is Rhys Thomas, I'm a consultant neurologist here at the Royal Victoria Infirmary in Newcastle and a neuroscientist working at Newcastle University. Historically, neurology has been a, a more competitive specialty, um, although I think you've got to take that with a pinch of salt, because I think some of the competition is people who want to remain within a specific geographic location, and if you're unlucky enough that there are three or four great people within your, your peer group who are all going for one or two spaces, you're, there will be a bit of a bottleneck. I think the biggest bottleneck are people who want to remain within London, you know, some of the London training is excellent, and there's a... Um, and I, uh, an appreciation that living in London, being a, a student and junior doctor in London is, is really attractive. But there are quite frequently training opportunities um, throughout the UK and there are quite frequently consultant neurology vacancies throughout the UK too. So I wouldn't be put off by the competitive nature. Sometimes there's a bit of grade inflation, so you may not need a higher degree to get into neurology training, but if you're, all your peers have a MD or PhD, you may find that there's that inflation. And there certainly has been a bubble within London and Cambridge, perhaps, uh, of that. 